continue today, and I hope you all are eager and excited and passionate. Right? Delve into your Bibles and let's see what's happening here now. So we talk about poverty. They are the totally reliant on God, dependent on God for everything. Not just saying, but in action. And that brings out three basic principles, or we could say three basic truths. What are they? The way to power lies in recognition of our own weakness. So what we're moving, we, we, we internalizing this poverty, that, 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 that lack of prestige and into your own weakness, your own sinfulness. Lord, I am a sinner. Have mercy on me, God, I am a sinner. Through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. The way to goodness lies in the acknowledgement and confession of sin. Lord, have mercy on me a sinner. We are all sinners. We have all done wrong. It is like what? Admission of our own defeat. I am really a sinner. I am an alcoholic. I really do this. I, I, I. But you're not doing that to pull down yourselves. I do that because God is there and he will help me. It reminds us or ought to remind us of the prodigal son. I will leave this place and go to my father. Of course, when he was wealthy, as we say, wine, woman and song, he couldn't be bothered about the father. When he had to toss up with the hogs and the pigs for food, he said, mm -mm, I can't take it. I will leave this place and go to my father. So dear friends, that poverty, that poverty in spirit is useful, very, very important. He is wise, wise, he is the wisest person who knows self to be very ill-qualified for the attainment of wisdom. I saw Plato to tease the mind a bit. He is the wisest person who knows self to be very ill-qualified for the attainment of wisdom. We continue tomorrow, please God.